Hey, what's up you guys? So today I'm actually going to show you how to put those ATM monitors on top of your ATM machine like I showed you guys in my last video. If you haven't seen my last video, go ahead and check that out. I'll link it somewhere down here or up here. But I'm going to show you guys how quick and easy it is to actually install these toppers and how you guys can go ahead and do the same on your ATM machine so you can start making some, you know, monthly ad revenue from these toppers. Hey, what's up you guys? So today I'm actually going to take you along with me and we're actually going to be filling up one of our ATM machines and then we're also going to be installing this ads on ATMs box onto the top of our ATM machine um, so we can play images, videos, advertisements on top of our ATM machine and we're going to make somewhere in the range of like 50 bucks to 100 bucks extra in ad revenue just because we're placing this on the top of our ATM machines and playing advertisements with this monitor and this monitor arm. That's how it's gonna sit on top of our machine. So, I mean, let's not waste any more time. Let's just jump right into it. So I sped this video up for you guys just because, you know, I don't wanna drag it on. And you guys see me do every single little thing. So pretty much what I'm doing first is I'm actually refilling my machine. So all I do is I just open the, the door, take out the cassette, you know, take the money out of my pocket, put the money in and then put the cassette back in, lock everything up. So everything's locked up right now. I'm just fumbling with my keys here. Um, Got to find the right one. So as I open the top, I actually have to pop out that little round plastic piece so I can actually maneuver this ATM arm in so I can actually fit the monitor on top of my ATM. So I have it positioned in a certain way and I actually locked it down in a certain way so that way the arm doesn't really move. So all I'm doing here is, I know it's kind of hard to see, but I'm actually putting the screw through the hole and then I'm actually taking the bolt or the nut and I'm screwing the nut on from the inside. And once I have that thing locked in place, you know, it's not going to go anywhere because I have it screwed on so tight. So now what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to take the the OptConnect, the wireless router, and I'm going to actually stick it up top because it's actually a little easier to maneuver and play with if it's up top uh, versus if it's down inside of the vault door. So right here, I actually had to move my my monitor. The monitor was on the ground, but this little girl actually came by. I don't know, maybe she was like five or six years old and started stomping on my monitor. So I actually had to pick that thing up and move it over to the side. But, you know, once I have, uh, you know, everything safe and secure, um, I actually position the arm into place and then I can take my monitor and I can actually lay it on top of the arm and you do that with four screws on the back so i'm kind of just fumbling with the screws right now and i i got them both set into place so right now i'm putting in the bottom two screws um that way i can fully secure this monitor and the arm to the atm machine so once it's all nice and secure, I'm just going to double check it right here to make sure it's good. Then I'm going to turn it on to make sure, you know, power is going to my topper. And once that, that power is good, I'm going to connect everything up and everything should run pretty smoothly. So right now it's just loading up the, the regular boot screen. And once it's actually booted up, it's going to come to the screen. And in the meantime, I actually forgot to input the eight thousand dollars that i put in into the vault door i forgot to actually put that into the back end so that's what i just did there so look as you can see the atm monitor is now up and running so this is the finished product guys and i'm very impressed on how well this thing turned out man i'm in love with this thing i will be putting this on pretty much every atm that i own so stay tuned for that and i suggest you guys do the same as well if you haven't gotten your ATM topper, I will leave a link in the description below. So make sure you go ahead and grab those toppers. And again, for those of you who have seen my last video, I am still doing that giveaway for that ATM machine. So make sure you go ahead and check out that video. Or if you just want to jump straight into, you know, purchasing an ads on ATM box to enter the giveaway, we have about 23 spots, I think, left. So once those spots are gone, you know, we will give the ATM machine away. So make sure you guys go ahead and jump on that right now before it's too late. So that is all for this video, guys, and I will see you in the next one. Peace.